Uh, the Ashani talks about how we have to delegate, and it's mentioned how there should be leaders of thousands, leaders of hundreds, leaders of fifties, and leaders of tens. And there was an individual who one time came over to me and he said, I'm stressed out. I'm like, what's going on? What happened? Why are you so overwhelmed? I'm working day and night, nine to five, five to nine. And he was in a Russian background. And I asked him, how do you say work in Russian? And he answered me, robota. I'm like, that's exactly what you are. You're a robot. You wake up, you go to work, you go to sleep. You wake up, you go to work, you go to sleep. You have no life. You can't do everything yourself. You can't be working. He was starting a business and he was trying to make it successful. He was working day and night. I told him the importance of delegating. Delegate down in order to go up. I love that quote so much. You have to delegate down in life in order to go up. You can't do everything yourself. There's another beautiful quote. No one could do everything, but everyone could do something. If a person takes that to heart, it won't be overwhelmed and overworked. Like Yitro told Moshe Rabbeinu, his son-in-law, he was overwhelmed with lines upon lines of people asking him questions. You have to delegate down, you have to have leaders, and he has certain characteristics that they need to have. But every single individual, every single person could take this lesson to heart of delegating, not taking too much upon yourself, not to be overwhelmed, not to be stressed out, but to Be'ezat Hashem, have others to help out. Be'ezat Hashem will see success in all of our endeavors. We should see the Geulah Shlemah, the Kuli Redemption, Be'emirah, Be'enus, 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 Be'